Ladies and gentlemen, it is showtime. Welcome to some more Lower League E-Cup action. I am your commentator for today's match between Delaware Rising Football Club, that's who we're hoping for, and the competition Dynamo FC St. Clouds. So we are now in the knockout stage in Lower League E-Cup. Nathan is our boy on the sticks, and he made it through the group stage and actually was voted MVP of Group B, so congratulations, Nathan. Nice work. And now it is the knockout stage. Here's how it works. Essentially, normal, if you watch soccer, European soccer, the knockout stage, each knockout individual pairing will have a first leg and a second leg, and ultimately, whoever wins out of those two legs will advance to the next round and it is showtime here we go we have liverpool versus psg quick start here crossing off the ball and for reference delaware rising has a psg with nathan on the sticks and st cloud they are rolling with liverpool for reference there is a knockout stage round draw and a show that happened, but a cross in real quick here by PSG, but defended well. But a good step, and PSG applying pressure, crosses the ball in, and another headed clearance away. But there was a lower league E-Cup knockout round draw and show, and there were predictions, and actually Delaware Rising with Nathan on the sticks is predicted to win by one goal in today's match. Let's do that. Let's get that dub. Liverpool trying to mount an attack of their own and crosses the ball in, but gets deflected, but defended well. Holding some nice position, nice passing in the midfield, but a foul on Liverpool taken quickly by PSG trying to make up that space in the midfield has it out wide flicked in Ooh, cleared just away to the top of the box and a good step by Liverpool's defense and now we'll see what Liverpool can do an interesting little fact about Nathan Nathan Schwalik who is representing us he is of course one of the founders of Delaware Rising but this is his first ever competitive FIFA match up type of tournament ever. So his first experience is with the lower league E-Cup and a great ball through by him. And the keeper reads it well, comes out and saves. But yes, the lower league E-Cup is Nathan's first ever official FIFA tournament. Doing extremely well, made it to the knockout rounds. We're super excited. Now Mane trying to break through that back line with his speed but shouldered off well, and possession changes hands, but Liverpool ends up getting it at the top of the box, but a good interception, and now PSG can hopefully go here on the break. And Nathan's style of play, of course, changes with each game, and now is able to cross it in the box, and it looks like it comes off of a Liverpool defender. It gets a foot to it. Oh, but apparently not. It is ruled out for a goal kick. But getting a lot of crosses in the box, which is beautiful to see. But as I was saying, Nathan's style likes to build up, maintain possession, and eventually wear down his opponent and takes a quick shot here, looks like, from the wing and saved by the keeper. But does try to wear down his opponents and get through eventually that back line. And we'll see if he's able to do it in this game here. We hope so. And Liverpool, oh, looks like Mane may have been through, but a sliding tackle from a PSG player stops him. And Liverpool gets a free kick in a dangerous area, but it looks like it was Trent Alexander-Arnold who takes that and hits it pretty much straight right up to the keeper. And oh, a wonderful outlet pass by Kaylor Navas and a Lovely little low ball. Oh, and it's just bouncing around. <laughs> Looks like the Liverpool defender tried to clear it, flicks it off of his own keeper, but they do get it away. Now PSG regained possession in the midfield. 
Looks like tries to play it through, but intercepted well. Now what can Liverpool do here? On a potential break. Nice possession, great pass out on the wing. Salah, magical touches, and tries to flick it into the box maybe, but deflect it away, and PSG take it back. And now hopefully can go on a break of their own. Now Liverpool holding possession, play it back to the keeper, but intercepted off of the keeper's pass. Oh, and what a save! He had players in the middle, couldn't give it to him, tried to flick it around, curl it, but the keeper saved it. That was a fantastic opportunity, but awesome goalkeeping, and it had to be. Wow, Allison coming in clutch for Liverpool. Now Liverpool trying to make a run of their own, but slowing things down a little bit, maintaining some more possession. Now Mane up top, flicks it through to Wijnaldum, Wijnaldum, one-on-one -on -one with the keeper, saved! Oh, what a save by Kaylor Navas. That is just magic. And now it's three on four here. PSG trying to break through, a little through ball here. Di Maria now out on the wing, going up against Virgil van Dijk. Flicks it in, header, goal! Di Maria with a lovely ball into the box, and it is headed in around Allison Mbappe rising to get the first goal of the match. Beautiful play by Nathan and his PSG squad to bring Delaware rising up 1-0 against St. Cloud. And like I mentioned, this is Nathan's first ever FIFA tournament or competition that he's ever been in. And it is exciting to watch, especially because he just got that goal right on the edge of halftime. Oh, what a match this is going to be. We'll see if that goal opens things up. But you love to see, if you're a Delaware Rising fan, the goal right before halftime to build up that momentum and now take that swing into the second half. I was talking to Nathan a few weeks ago about his first ever match that he played in the lower league E cup. He got that win very excited about it. And it's awesome to see him be able to hold his own in these types of competitions, especially because I am obviously not representing us on the sticks because he is a much better player than I am. That's why I'm here behind the camera commentating and chatting with all of you guys. And now we are underway here. We'll see if Liverpool changes up tactics or anything of the sort. It looks like no changes were made personnel-wise by either team. And some awesome footwork by Mane down on the wing to keep the ball in and chip it over the sliding defender. But good defense in the end by PSG and a lovely through ball to Neymar. What can he do? Takes it out on the wing, crosses it in, low cross. Ooh, that looks like it hurts. Almost finds Mbappe, but... The keeper ends up grabbing it, but Mbappe and the keeper collide. But since this is FIFA, no injuries. PS3 trying to mount another attack. Lovely little through ball there. Neymar with the touch. Gets it in. What a goal. Oh, a beautiful through ball. And Neymar with the quick touch knocks it in. And now a pause coming from the St. Cloud team what are they gonna do they're gonna make some changes here was it just a frustration pause we will find out but a lovely goal here it does not look like any personnel changes were made so it could have been strategic and you know when i hear saint cloud i know they're dynamo fc saint cloud i'm assuming saint cloud is probably the city they're actually from central minnesota so i'm assuming that is the case but whenever i say St. Cloud, I want to say Charlie St. Cloud. It's an awesome book, awesome movie. I'm a huge fan. All right, back to the game. We've had some possession in the midfield here, just bouncing back and forth. But now a potential break here for PSG. And Mbappe has it cutting into the box. Flicks it through. It goes through the keeper. It's in. It's in. Goal number three for Nathan and Delaware rising. This is phenomenal. The two strike partners up top, Neymar and Mbappe, cannot stop scoring. And we are now in the 60th minute 
Delaware rising up 3-0. What a beautiful game for Delaware rising and Nathan here. Whew. Now Liverpool getting some possession in the box. What a save. That was immaculate. Fantastic save by Kaylor Navas. But what is happening here? It looks like maybe a penalty. Oh, it is a penalty. They got not even fall down. Get out of here. Salah taking the penalty. And Kaylor Navas goes the wrong way. Gives a lifeline now to Liverpool and Dynamo FC St. Cloud. We'll see what happens if Nathan can keep the momentum swing on his side or if that goal will change things and give a little hope to Liverpool and maybe up there playing here a little bit. But another quick ball in. Oh my gosh, by PSG. That one kind of came out of nowhere. Lovely low cross into the box, but unfortunately not finished and just wide of the post. But PSG again on the attack. Now it's Neymar out on the wing. Passes it low. And it's just kind of bouncing around, trying to find its to feet. Oh! And it looks like Mbappe gets the ball, but then it goes just wide of the post. Nathan has the pedal pressed to the floor. He's not letting up. He wants the win. He wants it. And you love to see it. And again, another mounting attack. But Virgil van Dijk says no, not this time. But his pass is intercepted. Neymar in the box now, cutting out to the wing. Pushes it back. Good job to keep it in. And looks like ultimately offside is called against, I think it was Neymar going the other way. What can Liverpool do? They need a lifeline and maybe Wijnaldum can be it. He's open on the wing, but not fast enough to make anything happen in PSG regaining possession. PSG now on the tack again and just cutting through this defense. Looks like a shot is had, but it is blocked. That was Gomez making the block. Amane here up top. What's he doing? Gets through the defense, but Kempembe to the rescue ends up coming back, stepping in and clearing the ball out for a Liverpool corner. And good defense by PSG, having almost everyone back to defend that corner with just 15 minutes to go here. It looks like Mbembe blocks the cross, but does fall down. And whoo, a corner for Liverpool headed, looks like maybe by Salah, but saved by Kaylor Navas. He's having a pretty solid game here. Now Liverpool throw. Looking for something. Some type of action to get them back in this game. And they need something. Momentum is certainly on PSG's side. And now some strong possession by Liverpool. And maybe this is what they need. Maybe this will change the tide. But PSG's defense says, no, I'm not having it. Intercept off of a nice tackle. And going the other way, trying to feed Maria down the side, but intercepted nicely. And right as either team now is trying to get into the final third, solid defense has been played. But now Di Maria, it's, it's a 2v0 and a weird cross. That was, that was absurd. It was 2v0 against the keeper. Weird cross actually goes backward toward close to the 18. And then that player heads it from super far out and beats the keeper. Maybe the keeper's confused. I was confused. But hey, another goal for PSG. And it looks like Nathan is closing this one out in style. Going to get the dub with just four minutes to go here. Lovely match. Very strong showing for my brother Nathan on the sticks here for Delaware Rising. You'd love to see it as a DRFC fan. Quite spectacular. Oh, what a save by Kaylor Navas to keep it 1-4. Liverpool with the corner. Trying to get something. Virgil gets up, but obvious frustration. Nothing going their way today as PSG, obviously the better team in this first leg. 
and PSG still still trying to get through, maintain the little possession, take some time off the clock, but we have two added minutes here. Two added minutes for Liverpool. Now try to get through, but looks like a foul was called, maybe offside. PSG playing for an offside as well as they flick it down to the corner, but we are now at full time, ladies and gentlemen. The first leg goes to Nathan Schwalick of Delaware Rising. We love to see it. We're super excited. And again, like I keep mentioning, this is Nathan's first ever official FIFA tournament. It's an exciting time for him. For me, because I'm pumped for our squad of Delaware Rising fans. It's an exciting time to be a Delaware Rising fan as big things are happening on the esports front, but also on the actual legit club front as well. So Nathan, nice work, fantastic game. Couldn't have played better. And that penalty, very weird, very weird. But it's an exciting, exciting time to be a fan of Delaware Rising. And I'm not going to lie, I didn't know this. But it looks like they play the second leg right away. So I'm glad I stayed on the stream on our Twitch channel so you can watch all of our E Cup action and our FIFA action on Twitch. Just search Della Rising and you'll find us. But I did not know. I did not know that the second leg was directly after the first one. I thought there was a time gap. There is not. This is the hardcore knockout stage. I need to learn more about the E Cup and how it functions. But yeah, so uh, hopefully you're ready for some more <laughs> Delaware Rising action because it's coming right back at you with the second leg. And same thing here, uh, same setup as before with Dynamo FC St. Cloud. They will have Liverpool as their squad and Delaware Rising, your boys in blue, they will be representing with Paris St. Germain. It's going to be another good matchup. We'll see now that this match happens right away what it looks like for the St. Cloud squad, for the Dynamo FC group, if they're going to be able to take momentum from that previous game because Nathan had an absolute strong showing. So we'll see what happens and how they attack this game. If they are more conservative, try to maintain a little bit more possession also interesting to see what Nathan does. Is he going to attack, go hard again, try to demolish him from the start? I'd love to see that. I'd love to see the hustle. Go out, take the dub right away. Don't even give him any hope. Well, we'll see because kickoff has officially happened and welcome everybody to the second leg of this matchup between Dynamo FC St. Cloud and your boys, Delaware Rising. And again, no change here, of course, because Nathan is still representing us on the sticks. I'm your commentator for the second leg, Andrew Schwalick. If you didn't know, Nathan's my brother. And we are both the founders of Delaware Rising, so check us out. And a shot here, Liverpool trying to get in on the action early, but a lovely save by Kaylor Navas. And now they take a short corner, different from what they did in the first leg. Crossed in, woo Lovely little cross, awesome flicked in header, but man, Kilo Navas getting tested early, but up to the challenge. Another one, oh! And it's almost saved by Kilo Navas, but after another corner, the header goes in, and Dynamo FC St. Cloud takes the lead. This will be interesting. Now, I should have more information as your commentator for this match. But I don't. I don't know how the legs work. If like one is home, one is away. What happens if they tie? Do they have to go to penalties? It's a great question that I don't have the answer for you for. I apologize. But hopefully we don't have to get to that because then I won't have to try to figure out the rules and explain it to you. But a shot now. Looks like from Di Maria on the wing, but saved from Allison. Two top tier keepers in this match. In this overall matchup. You'd love to see it. And personally, for me, keepers don't get enough attention. We all love the goals. It's all fantastic to see. And we may be seeing another one here with Salah on the wing. Ooh, nice cutback. Some fancy footwork. Good defense, though. And a foul? Yes, a foul is called on Liverpool. 
but keepers don't get enough love. There are some amazing saves out there that don't get the love that goals get. There are so many amazing keepers making so many amazing saves. I would love more highlights for that. You know, some possession trading back and forth here in the midfield. But now Neymar on the break. He's going to be one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. What's he going to do? Flicks it outside of the boot. Not enough power. Saved by Allison, who releases it quickly. But Liverpool now maintaining a bit more possession. A slower buildup as compared to last game. And it looks like on aggregate with the first leg. Ooh, a lovely through ball here. Now Neymar, what's he going to do? Passes into Verratti. Verratti scores! Marco Verratti makes it 1-1. PSG tying it up against Liverpool. Delaware rising. You love it. Lovely through ball. Catching that defense out. And as I was mentioning with aggregate, with that new goal, now it looks like it is 5-2 on aggregate with Delaware rising leading the way. And a little miscommunication looks like on the back line for Liverpool, but they do get possession back. Now out on the wing, it's Di Maria. Looking to put some fancy footwork on, I think it's Robertson, and does win a corner out of the situation. Take it quick. Headed up in the air. Kompembe now wins that one, but that goes out for a goal kick. Herrera, Neymar, comes back to get the ball. Di Maria trying to do something on the wing, but take it away. Liverpool could go on a break now, trying to do so down the wing, but not happening against defense from PSG. But, oh, a quick through ball almost catches the Liverpool defense out, but a good step ends that potential break. And as expected, Liverpool do have to be a bit more attacking. So they are bringing more players up from their defensive shape. And now here it is with one. Altum has a strike saved by Kaylor Navas. Corner for Liverpool. And they don't go short this time. But Kaylor gets a big fist on it. But only as far as the top of the D. Jota now. Flicks into the box. A header saved. Firmino tried to get that one in, but a good save. Just not enough power on that header. And you can clearly see the back line for Liverpool a bit depleted because they do try to attack more often, which leaves them susceptible to these counterattacks like we're seeing right now. And Neymar's pace down the wing is just too much for Gomez, who's trying to win it back. Does get in. Oh, it flicks off Gomez. Neymar gets it back, tries a shot, but Allison was ready for it. Now, Allison drops it to his feet, plays it out in a great through ball. Now it's Mane using his pace. And Mane scores! Hits that side netting. And now, folks, we have a ball game. It is two to one. So on aggregate, that makes it 5 3. So Liverpool just down two goals. Ooh, lovely little pass out. To Florenzi on the wing. And Wijnaldum diving tackle, but Florenzi gets it back. A slight chip over to maybe Neymar, but can't find it. And Liverpool now trying to take a break, but possession bouncing back and forth. Maybe they can get one more attack in here as it is the 42nd minute now. Right before halftime. Woo. And a crunching tackle. Looks like that may have been from Neymar, potentially, and goes out for a throw. Lovely tackle. And Liverpool trying to go on the attack here. Mane has it in the box, gets shot, saved. Kaylor Navas. And Liverpool's corner is defended well. And we'll see how much time is added on. As Liverpool maybe can mount one more attack before halftime. And they are able to. A through ball. Amazing ball to Wijnaldum. And Liverpool scores. What is happening? It is now 3-1. to one. And there is only one added minute. And that will take us to halftime. Holy smokes. What a match we have going on here. It is 
to one. Liverpool leads this one. So this is a crazy match because the first leg was one four to one by Delaware Rising. So Dynamo FC St. Cloud have a chance. Only down one goal on aggregate can tie things up in this second half. It looks like a totally different ball game. Momentum is such a crazy thing. So when you can score that first goal in FIFA, that momentum certainly helps and definitely eases the nerves as well. Now we're kicking off. What will Nathan do? And he's already out on the wing and tries to cross it with Mbappe, but it goes out for a goal kick. So it's looking like he wants to attack early and get a goal back to put that goal, to put that aggregate back up two goals. And certainly pressing with his two forwards. And now Liverpool mounting an attack of their own. Mane gets it out to Salah on the wing. Salah tries to feed it back to Mane, but isn't able to find him. Only finds a PSG defender. Now Mbappe comes back to get the ball. Neymar, whew, lovely little flick to get around that defender. And a stellar step by Gomez. That's what Liverpool is really missing in real life. They need those strong core center backs to be able to step in and tackle like that. And whew, lovely tackle on the other end now from PSG's defense. Neymar up top. Does he have enough pace to get around? Flicks it through. And oh, what a goal from Neymar. Gets one-on-one -on -one with the keeper with a defender on his back. Flicks it upper 90. This is what we love to see, folks. Goals galore. 3-2 now with Dynamo FC St. Cloud leading. And a shot by Salah. Good save. Kaylor Navas again. And they are leading Delaware Rising with a corner. And oh, what a strong header that was from the corner for Liverpool. And what a match, folks. So aggregate now, you're going to make me do some math, which is very difficult. With a quick break here, gives me some more time to do some math. Verratti out on the wing, flicks it in. Oh, it's a goal. It's a goal. He's onside. And it's another goal. Mbappe scores this time. Delaware Rising up three now on aggregate, which this match is now tied 3-3. Three, three. Threes all around, folks. This is exciting. You love to see the goals. You love to see both teams attacking, which now Liverpool is going hard. They know they need to, being down three goals on aggregate. And PSG not letting up. They are attacking hard. Di Maria on the wing, flicks it through. It looks like he will be offside, gets the ball in. But an offside flag has risen. Has arisen? Same thing. Offsides was called. And we didn't need VAR for it. Now it's Jota. Mane up top. Liverpool getting some numbers behind the ball. And a lovely step from Marco Verratti. But a foul is called right at the top of the D. So a very dangerous position. And it looks like it will be Trent Alexander-Arnold taking the shot. Flicks it through and goes right to the keeper. Not his best penalty. And Kilo Navas taking time, gathering himself. And lovely ball by Kaylor Navas to the corner. And it looks like Neymar will get on the end of this. Who flicks it in, low through ball. And it goes off of Mbappe's foot. What a strike. Are you kidding me? And it's another goal for Delaware Rising who find their stride. Nathan is mercilessly attacking this game. And he wants that win. He wants to go to the next round of the lower league E-Cup. And you can't blame him. And it looks like he will be if he continues to play this way. And now on aggregate, up four goals. And as a Delaware Rising FC fan... It's a beautiful day. And he wants more. Nathan is still hunting with Di Maria on the wing. Flicks and low through ball, but this time cleared away from the Liverpool defense. But Pereira steps up, takes the ball. And Neymar, lovely little spin, maintaining possession. And he ooh, looks like he almost flicks it through. But it is out for a corner kick. 
And they go short with it. Marco Verratti putting on a little move, getting into the box. Doesn't know what to do with it. <laughs> He's such a tight angle, takes a shot, but it is saved by Allison. So another corner to the Delaware Rising. They go short with it. It's Verratti again. Cutting in and taken off of him this time. And what will Liverpool do on a potential break opportunity? Robertson going down the wing. Tries to flick it through, but Marquinhos says no thank you. And Liverpool now giving up a break of their own with Di Maria on the wing. And Liverpool is able to stop it, but it still finds its way back to Di Maria, trying to put on some fancy footwork to get to the corner, and Maria just hustling. Gets the ball back, now it's Florenzi at the top of the ball. Top of the D, nothing doing, intercepted. Now Liverpool, what are they going to do on this break? They do keep it in, it's Jota on the wing. Gets by that first defender and tries to play it through, but Kempembe says, that ball is mine. And it looks like, oh, crunching tackle. Lovely one, though, from Salah, who wins the ball. Looks like everyone was a little hesitant to think that that was a foul, but it was not. Liverpool throw right near the corner flag. And PSG looking to play their way out and do so, but gives up possession now at the top of the D. Oh, a lovely through ball for Mane. Mane scores! Lovely through ball. Mane, not having any of it, just slots it home with some power and beautiful placement past Kaylor Navas, and now that makes it 4-4. So now it is down to three goals on aggregate. However, we are now into the 85th minute. But Salah is not giving up. Salah, it's another goal. Mo Salah scores for Liverpool. Aggregate is now down to two goals. This is nuts. What's going to happen? 5-4 is your match here. And guys, I don't even know what it is on aggregate. All I know is Della Rising up 2. I can't even give you the full aggregate scores because math is hard. Liverpool now on the wing. Can they get another? Florenzi says not today. And he gets fouled, but his vantage being played and looks like they are trying to play the offsides trap, and they do get the offside call. Whew, very risky to play on FIFA, but hey, when you can do it right, when you're confident, good for you, folks. Good for you. And it's now Neymar on the wing, and there are two added minutes. And it looks like he's just holding it in the corner, trying to run that clock down. Mbappe now gets it to the top, has a shot, and it is deflected away. And we are now past... Two minute mark who Mbappe crosses the ball in and it is cleared away. And folks, that is the match on aggregate. Delaware Rising with Nathan Schwalick on the sticks gets the W. And again, don't ask me to tell you the aggregate score. I think it's it's nine. Nine to five? Six, seven, eight, nine? No. Nine to nine to six. I don't know. Math is really difficult, but overall, Delaware Rising FC advances on aggregate to the next round of the knockout stage. Nathan, congratulations. Awesome. Two matches. I wasn't expecting to get this much FIFA in tonight. I thought it was just one first leg match, but there were actually two, and I loved it because this was one of the craziest matches I've seen with the full scoring this one being five to four. So ultimately, if it's five to four, the last game is four to one. So would that make aggregate nine to five? So then that difference was three? Fam, I don't know. But all I know is Delaware Rising with Nathan Schwalick on the sticks is moving on to the next round of the lower league E-Cup. And you love to see it. You love to see it. The boys in blue going strong, and we'll see you here on our Twitch channel and on our YouTube channel very soon with another match because we have two other individuals playing on the computer, so desktop. They play PC as well as a PlayStation player as well. So tons more Lower League E-Cup action, more FIFA action coming your way, so make sure to stay tuned to the Twitch channel and our YouTube channel as well. Plus, big things happening on our club side as well. You'll want to be 
checking out all of our social for that. But this is Andrew Schwalek, your commentator for today's match, signing off. I will see you in a, another match very soon. And again, Nathan, congratulations. Fantastic match. This was a fun one. This was a fun one. I hope they all are. We'll see you in the next match.